Today we're heading out with Nicola and Ian from Umeki's to try and catch some fish for the restaurant and try out their new experience they're calling the Umeki's Hook and Cook. Basically the Umeki's Hook and Cook is where you guys can head offshore, catch some fish with these guys, and then bring it back to the restaurant and have it cooked up right here for you guys, local Hawaiian style. We're gonna cut to yesterday's footage of us out on the boat catching fish, and then we're gonna see you guys back here to show you the inside process on how our local Hawaiian fish go from out there in the ocean to in here in the restaurant and then served right here to your plate. I have the biggest ahi by far that I've ever had hooked up in Hawaii. <laughs> that Ziploc bag with that spreader bar, straight up piece of plastic. The sharks eat them when they're big or no? Yeah? <laughs> sharks all over out here. Hurry, 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 hurry. Oh, oh, bro. He had the shark on you, pulling up the shark. I had the shark the whole time. <laughs> oh, 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 go. Aku. Well, that was a good practice run. Two sharks in a row was a lot of work. Switch into this electric reel. Still got my Ziploc bag. This electric thing might be the way to jig. Working hard. You got one? Yep. Fish on! There you go. Sharky? No. Boosters. The Shibi? There you go. Hey, little fish. Revenge was successful. Nice. With the plastic bag. I could really get used to this fishing. Look at this guy over here sweating. You're going? Look at me. Just using my thumb. That's it. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Yes. This is the way. Go, go. 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 Go, 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 go! Go! Go, go, go! Oh! Wait, why is it not going? What happened there? The reset? Sharky. Yeah. Another shark. shark. Mr. Shark. Fish on! Let's double up! Oh shit! There you go! There we go! There we go! Come on! No! Come back! Come back! Oh! There we go! Two fish! Yes! I can't walk, so you're walking. Check this out! Guys, this is the way to fight a fish right here. There you go. What you got? There you go. Nice. On the plastic. Guys, this is it. Guys, look, I'm fighting, I'm fighting a tuna. I'm fighting a tuna. All right, all right. Over there. Check it out. Here we go, all a little better. Check it out. Oh, 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 oh. yes, stoked. Look at that. On the freaking bags, on the electric reel, how cool is that? Do it on the Ziploc so they can go back in the Ziploc after you caught them. Yes. <laughs> By far the easiest tuna I've ever fought in my life. This, about this. 20 more rows. This is this is gonna be a thing. See if we can make this happen again. There you go. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh! There we go. There we go. Oh, lost it. Hey, the little rat. Awesome. Get back. There you go. Make it walk, Paul. 
My left thumb is a little tired. <laughs> oh, missed it. You missed one? Huh. There you go. There. Full throttle. There we go. Full throttle. There, you're full throttle. Oh. Oh. Reset. There we go. Without a doubt, this is the way to fight a fish. Oh, we got each other. Oh, shit. Here, you can leader yours from this side. Shit, I just dropped it. Here. Here we go. What you got? Other one. Nice. On the freaking plastic. Get another one. Oh. There you go. Nice. Still got the plastic. There yeah. you go. I still got the plastic. Guys, I can film. I can jig. This is amazing. Look at me go. <laughs> We're in the zone right now. This is the spot. Double double. I want to see a real one. There you go. There we go. Here we go. The battle begins, working hard. Thanks guys, see you tomorrow in Mekis. You want it all? I do. Sam, what do you think? This is our Ono from yesterday. Is it? It's it. Are you just making this up? I might be making it up, but it's the same size. <laughs> All right guys, so we're right here in the cut room. Ian just brought out that tuna we shot yesterday. And he's gonna take us through the whole process of turning this tuna into kind of our lunch, kind of poke, everything that they do right here at Umeki's. Ours are a little smaller than his, huh? Yeah, <laughs> small thing. My ahi cutting skills need a little bit of work, so maybe I'll learn something here. Cut down the head, cut down the other side. Yeah, I always get screwed up right there on that fin. Yeah, I go backwards with it a little bit easier. And skin comes off. Now, is this the same for big ones or small ones? Oh, big ones will do it different. And then bloodline comes right out. So, we're gonna leave a little bit of meat on the bones because we're gonna do fried bones for you guys. Sweet! Yeah. Never had it. Flip. All right. Yep. All I've heard about is fried ahi bones. I mean, Nicole was talking about it yesterday. I was like, we've, we've never done that. I don't know why. That bottom line, no bottom problem. Line. Yep, boom, done. Easy peasy. Yep. Okay, now from here, I'm gonna take off the head and the colors. Yeah. Now, this is just the way I cut fish, you know? Okay. No right way, no wrong way. It's just for sure. Whatever is... works for you, you know? For sure. Oh. It goes right. What do you think? I feel like I'm in Narnia or something. I love this restaurant. So like, it's cool to see like the magic behind it. Ian just showed me this fish box here, which is crazy. And that was definitely my Ono in that. Yes, got some Kampachi, some Ahi. Some ours? Yep, it's ours. All those little Ahis are too. I have never actually eaten one of these things. They're really oily. They're really oily, yeah. okay. Sick, like any kind of trivoli or whatever. Yeah. Pretty crazy to see like our fish come from the ocean yesterday, be brought right here, put on the ice, cut right there in the store, and then sold to everybody within 24 hours. What did you find? Lido gave me a snack. And it's amazing. You know, I know we do this all the time where we, we go out and we catch fish and then we come back and we eat them. But it's not like professionally prepared here at the restaurant, so that's pretty sick. I'm trying to do this the proper way. Professional. Mm. I caught that. I'm so proud. That poke looks incredible. I don't know what flavor that is. We're gonna find out, but it looks epic. Oh my God. It's sweet and salty. It's incredible. Oh my God, it's so good. You have to try it. That is incredible. I don't know what it is. It's crazy flavor. I don't know. It might be a little quiet. I want to try this other one. Hold on. Now that's your ahi limu or something like that. Your more standard one. Uh, we're gonna have to find out exactly what Lido gave us first, but that was me and Sam cannot stop, stop talking about it. We're like, that was the best poke we've ever had in our life. 
that is that ahi. I worked really hard pushing the button down yesterday to catch this fish. That ahi is fantastic. Straight out of the water yesterday, 24 hours ago, swimming around out there in the ocean. Check this out. Yep, this is the ahi bones, fried ahi bones and the fried collar. And inside there, it'll show you and chili pepper water. I've never, I've never done this. I know, I know this is the thing that everybody does here. They eat the collars and eat the bones, but I'm so stoked to try it. So, oh my God, I'm so excited. Wow, that's really good. Check that out. Now this is a piece that totally you would just toss, you know, and instead here it is being turned into a whole entire meal. That's fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Right against the bone. Tons of meat in there. People keep looking at us filming ourselves eat. They want to know who we are. The Umeki's hook and cook. Guys, this could be you. That was absolutely fantastic. Everything from the really, really cool fishing day that we had yesterday to then cooking up everything right here in the restaurant and seeing really where like our Hawaiian seafood comes from and how it makes it from the ocean straight onto your plate here at our local restaurant. Yep. I'm glad I wore my stretchy pants. <laughs> Highly recommend the Umeki's hook and cook. Check it out for yourself. Hit them up. And we'll see you guys next time right here on Ryan Myers Expeditions.